That's one of his old shirts. You can never sit and just drink a cup of coffee. <laughs> school and I'm not wearing any makeup oh well just got to get used to me not wearing makeup um but um I was just hoping that um she was still going to be here so he told me to come pick him up at 5 30 and so I got here like six minutes early I guess six or seven minutes early and um hopefully I could be able to get this on camera of her me hitting him the bag but he's going to give it to her so we got five minutes and um I'm going to get out and uh probably grab my keys and I'm going to give it to him and then I'll be able to get to meet her so it is getting a little chilly out it's like 56 right now outside and um, um but yeah when he told me the situation this morning it was just like oh my gosh it's like I started caring about her like so so let's see what happens. <laughs> uh, I mean, they've been together like for a month now. So next month, hopefully, uh, will be two months. Oh At least it's oh not God. glitterified. That's one of his old shirts. <laughs> yeah. Hello, you guys. Today is the 17th of December. And I'm um, having me some you ever made tea? I had some black tea um, that I usually get in like a K-cup, which is Twinings, English breakfast, black tea. And um, I usually have that first, or sometimes I'll have your made tea. I made me some your made tea and I put honey in it. It's like my favorite cup. Um, and I put some also some Demetrius Earth tea. And I got to sleep all night last night, and, um, oh my gosh, um, so far I'm not having so much pain as I was, um, a couple of days ago, and, um, yesterday I did have, like, no pain in my stomach. Usually I do, like, that's mean when I have to, like, you know, go to the bathroom. So, I'm on my day six. Or stay, no, I started on Monday, so yeah, it's day six. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, so far I'm like, because this past week I have not been getting much sleep, you know, have to wake up so early. And it's like, man, it's, I, it's like I wish I didn't have to wake up so early. And I'm like still tired, as you can see. Um, try to make me some more. <clears throat> you know, tea to wake me up and I put Demetrius Earth, if I start putting Demetrius Earth like in my tea, like every morning, um, it'll, you know, scrape everything that's on my 
inside my intestine walls and everything. And also, it'll, you know, if I take it like every day, it'll help give me like a little bit of energy as well. And I have to drink a lot of water afterwards. And, um, but yeah, <clears throat> I haven't got to um, edit my, uh, finish editing my other vlog that I just did like from like what, I think it was like from last week or whatever. So I'm gonna try to edit that today. And if you're seeing this now, it's probably already up and everything. So, so yeah, I'm gonna try to, try to just get the um, outro and everything. And um, yeah, so. I got to, I can't believe I got to meet my, um, boyfriend, I mean, my boyfriend's, <laughs> meet my son's girlfriend last night, and I just, I was like, oh my gosh, and she, I was like, I gave her a hug, I wish my son would got it, you know, I took a picture or something, and me giving her a hug, you know, I didn't have no makeup on, and she was telling my son, like, your mom, I'm like, I love your mom, she's so pretty, I'm like, I'm so pretty. I'm like, does this look pretty to y'all? <laughs> so I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I might have, you know, hopefully, God willing. Oh, you know, she's 16 and my son's 18, two years apart. And, um, yeah, two years apart and kind of like two months apart. Two years and two months Oh my goodness. Two, two. I'm like, <laughs> oh my God, God is so good. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh my goodness. Two, two. Like, what? I'm like, two years and two months. I'm like, what? Because he, he's born in, you know, April and she's born in February. I'm like, oh my gosh. She's born like the day after her, after like my, my son's father's birthday. And even though he was born in 1984 and, um, but it's just like mind blowing to me. I'm like, oh wow. So next year, I'm definitely gonna have to get her something if they're still together. I'm like, mm-hmm. It's like, oh. God willing, I would take that little, I'll take that girl, and I'm like, hey, I'm like, do you want to, um, go get a pedicure or something, or, or get your nails did, you know, I would, like, literally do that for her, especially on her birthday, but I'm sure, I don't know if her parents will, because I know that they work all day and everything, but, but you know, she'll probably like be in school. So yeah. I'll have to insert a little picture of her, like two pictures of with her and my son. I mean, she's like, I don't know, maybe a, she's like this, like tall, you know, she's like, probably like to hear to me. And, um, but yeah, <clears throat> um, I can't believe I had like, I had like four eggs yesterday because I made, I didn't get to show y'all what I ate yesterday. Um, I had my pancakes yesterday and then after that around lunch, I had um, maybe like a potato. Uh, I just like cut it up. I cut it up and I boiled it. And then after I boiled it, I kind of like drained it and everything. And after I drained it, I put it in the air fryer. And I put like garlic and I put like basil and everything to make it taste really good. It was so good. I wish I would be able to put like ketchup, but I can't have ketchup because you know, it's, it's acidic. So I'm kind of like doing a low acid diet. Um, so I get to eat peanut butter and jelly if I want to. You know, that's not really acidic, so I'm like, okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna have my bananas before they get really, really ripe. And yeah, I need to try to have at least like four eggs today. And uh, that kind of gets me, you know, a little bit of B12, vitamin D, and um, choline, whatever. 
and um but yeah um i'm trying to think if i'm gonna go to this thing again tomorrow what that i went to yesterday i wish i would got it on video but um i'm just you know wait and see because um i had a lady that called me i forgot what day she called me i'll have to look on my phone um when she called me she was you know calling to check up on me i mean who does that i mean you know, when you go to a church, you ever have somebody to call you, see how you're doing and everything. Um, but yeah, I, I feel like I want to go tomorrow because I want to know what the Lord has to, the, you know, tell me. You know, basically, you know, the Holy Spirit and everything has to tell me. And she was like, well, the Holy Spirit has something to tell you. He's not, he's not done with you. I'm like, I kind of figured that. So I know he's not done with me. So... Y'all better get excited for me because things are gonna, it's like, it's like what happened with Jesus when he flipped the tables. And I probably won't be able to, um, explain what happened until after, probably like next year. Because I heard like a lot of stuff is gonna happen this month, um, before next year some people are not gonna be able to go into next year so um so yeah i know that's kind of like like what who are you talking about um uh there's basically a spiritual war battle happening in the spiritual realm and everything and people that are not like walking in on the you know narrow gates you know to the narrow gate on the narrow path um you know not want to do what you call it god's um god's will or god's you know because god you know everybody has a purpose and everything so basically whatever he, he has a calling for your life because i didn't know what i'm supposed to be doing I just been, I'm going to have to explain this like in another video because this is going to be so long. Um, I can already tell that I have a calling for my life because, you know, I have a mission to do it. I've been wanting to do something for God's kingdom like since like maybe like two years ago. I was like, I want to do something for God's kingdom. And... And it's like, you know, because I had, you know, have so much, um, oh, I don't know what the words is. It's like, I know what, you know, all these people that are like so lost and they don't know what's going on and everything. Let me tell y'all, Jesus is like, literally like, he's coming back because he's coming back soon and that's why we need to get right with him and that's basically why everybody's you know doing their own thing don't want to do what god wants us to do you know they want to do what they want to do basically so that is just the path i'm on and the pastor told me last week, he said, don't look left, don't look right, don't look back. I'm like, I'm definitely not going to look back once this happens. I'm like, I just have to trust in the Lord. I told, I always tell him, I'm like, I'm going to trust you, whatever happens and everything. And I always tell him that. So, you know, things make it ugly. Especially this month. I don't know when it's going to happen, but... Once it, when it, once it does happen, then I'll have to explain it in, in another video. Um, so, but yeah, um, I know I get really good to show y'all like the foods I got to eat and everything. Like last night I had um, uh, baby spinach, um, bell, red bell pepper, chicken, and sweet potato. I just like cut it up, trying to do it like different than I know we go just put in the oven and bake it but I decided to cook it on the stove so yeah that's what I'm up to that's what guys want me to do he's like and I'll have to you know explain it more in another video um 
because uh, I'm sure God's going to want me to do something on my main channel once I, you know, once he, once I get through what I'm going through right now, that's when he's going to want to say, okay, this is what you got to do. I'm like, because, so, all right, you guys, I, I know this video is getting too long and I'm be talking and everything, but something I have to get off my chest, you know, because this is, this is the direction I'm heading. This is the direction I'm going. And nothing can stop it. The devil can't stop me. Can't stop Jesus. Can't stop God from doing it. So everything has to be exposed. Oh, oh my goodness, my sign is starting up. See, I mean, you guys, I mean, I just took a leg of D. Oh, I'm about to take an Echinacea Plus um, later. Um, you know, it was getting really cold in here. That's probably why my sinus is acting up. And, um, I even, you know, like I told, uh, your nurse and throat doctor, it was going to be doing this, especially when it gets really cold. My sinus always acts up. And, um, of course, my, my brother, like when he goes outside, he comes back in, he smells like an ashtray. So, um. But yeah, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna be making for dinner. Um, I'm making soft taco bake, but since I'm not gonna have <clears throat> like the dairy cheese, I'm gonna be using um, this cheese that I saw at Sam's, which is Carrie Gold uh, Duo Liner, and it's natural cheese, 100% natural cheese. Imported from Ireland, aged cheese with distinctive taste and a natural hint of sweetness. So what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to open it and I'm going to have to get like a zip up bag later. And I'm going to use the um, cheese grater. I can find it. Oh, it's harder to help me. <laughs> Try to find the cheese grater. I just put it underneath here earlier. Okay, here it is. This right here, um, not sure what side to use. Probably maybe this side might be better. I don't know. And yeah, so um, use the big ones for, you know, um, I wish I had, I like that the one that had like a receivable. This doesn't have the receivable. They used to have the one that has the receivable, but this one don't have it. It's like, really people, come on. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with these tortillas. I wish I would use the last. I mean, it comes with six tortillas, and I just used three already, and there's probably three left in here. Yeah, I don't have a big bag for that. So, what I'm going to do, since these were in the fridge um, earlier, I'm going to be using this. It says I can have, you know, refried beans, and and some beef. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add whatever I want on it and also the cheese last. And I'm not gonna put any like sauce on it or anything. Um, so yeah, let me try to open this up real quick. I'm gonna try to see if I can get y'all to watch it like from here if I can I have to get the um what you call a sticky thing
um, to get my phone pop socket out. Um, I just got done having me a snack. I didn't really get to show y'all what happened yesterday, but let's see. Look like my eyebrow makeup still on. It's not on over here. I guess I forgot to wash my face. Oh dang. Um, yeah, yesterday was something else. Let me tell you. Um, didn't expect. I even. I don't even know what happened yesterday. I was like in tears, and two or three people came up to me. Um, yesterday, and I had my hands like up in the arm, and you no, know, my arms are like so tired, you know, because I hadn't been working out. And, um, just, you know, basically praising the Lord and everything. And about three people came up to me and, uh, you know, they were speaking life over me, basically. And it was just amazing. And I never had that happen to me before. Sorry, I'm fixing my leggings here. I'm just wearing my leggings. I need, I can't wait to start working out again so I can work on this stomach. I mean, look at this. I mean, my stomach's still kind of bloated. So, I mean, I'm not really bloated, but it just, you know, I can't wait. I got two more days to I'm done with the, taking these antibiotics. And then after that, I have to look for the papers for doing the stool test and everything. And then I guess I probably could do that, like I think maybe like next week, you know, to check to see if the, I don't mean, I don't really feel any pain up here in my stomach, but this is where your stomach is on this side. And um, I don't usually feel anything. And I got good sleep last night, even though I woke up around three just to go to the bathroom. And then I was like, and I thought my babe, usually he takes, uh, my babe wakes up and uh, he takes Bella out to go potty. And for some reason he didn't come back to bed. And I was like, hmm, I kind of know why. But he, he said he couldn't fall back asleep because he had to take Bella out. And I thought he couldn't fall back asleep. I guess he slept down here. But... Once I figure out what happened, this, you know, once I find out, like, next month what happened. And, uh, because I, I, to me, I believe that, um, the, the enemy was getting irritated. Satan's little demons were getting a little bit irritated. And, um, but yeah, once, um, I understand and, and everything, um, Everything I'm going through right now, because I'm, I'm like, I have really no clue what I'm going through right now. I know I'm going through a hurting process. And, and right now we're in a major shift. The shift had be begun like last week. And, um, look at his clothes out. I only got one ball. I try to use dryer balls so it helps to save energy and time. And I usually, you see like the little dots on it? I put um, essential oils on it. And I don't know what happened to the other dryer balls. And pretty soon I got to wash these rags that my mom gave me. And um, I'm just washing his original clothes. Oh, yeah, we need to get some fabric sheets. We get a little static. Oh, some kind of electric shock. Don't want that. No. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to see what's going to happen. I mean, we got one week left. And can y'all believe it that Christmas is just around the corner? And I'm still, if you're watching this now, I'm like, you've probably already seen the last video I probably um, posted. Um... I'm always like trying to like try to see what kind of um, outro to put and usually you know usually it's pretty easy for me to do but 
But yeah, we need to get some fabric sheets. Some fabric sheets, Omega. I like the Omega fabric sheets. You know, especially when you have a whole lot of clothes. Um, dang, I don't want to put it on. My radio stopped. Don't know how that happened. Maybe I'm running out of, what do you call it, um, storage. But yeah, I gotta do some house cleaning. Take this upstairs. Put it in the laundry room. I'm gonna show y'all what this, kind of like what the stairway looks like right now, how it used to look. I mean, it looks a little bit clean. But um, my parents are supposed to be coming back home probably sometime today. I mean, I don't have my watch on. But uh, probably put some of these, like that, that, like um, in the storage room. So yeah, um, I'm probably gonna need to take, like I wanna have a end feature so I can, you know, start having some energy. But I, I can only have like my almond milk, herbal teas. I'm always having peppermint tea. Um, even like before I go to bed, I'll have peppermint tea with um, manuka honey and the other honey. Oh my god, I need to start working out. Oh my god, it's, it's heavy. <laughs> and it's like I want to clean our bedroom, but it's like I don't have, I have energy. I just don't have that much energy. It's like I'm gonna need like a, like the BCAA energy. That way I have some energy to clean and get this stuff done. So, okay. You can never sit and just drink a cup of coffee. <laughs> it always gets cold if you don't drink it like um, like fast. Mm -hmm. They do have these electric mugs that like heat up. I know my friend Ruth um, has that, but I'm sure they're really expensive. Like they heat up, your coffee stays like heated. It's crazy. Anyways, guys, good morning. Um, this morning, morning, my kitchen is a mess, by the way, guys. It was one of those days yesterday where I was just super exhausted. And I did pretty much nothing. Just kept my son alive. <laughs> kept the dogs alive. Kept my husband alive. All right. So, a couple weeks ago, I got this shoe rack. That's going to go kind of like by the stairway since I finally got it a little bit cleaned and mopped. And... I just put this, you know, to the side and everything. Not as stuff that happens, forbid, God forbid. If something happens, I'm taking this shoe rock with me. It go with me, you know? I bought it, it go with me. Cause I'm sure I would do something with it. Wow, no, um, tools. <laughs> See that? No tools required. Yeah. Okay. Should be easy peasy, right? Yeah. I guess y'all have to watch me do this. I mean, it's gonna be really easy. <laughs> shoes all right here usually you know they take them off i'm like well now you can take them off and put it there you know put it wherever you know so yeah it's good <laughs> 